not even close. It's Kasi Trach Ash. And pay attention to the Trach part. Yeah, back of the throat. What's up, everybody? My name is Lei Hua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on Twitch and TikTok at Lei Hua Superfina. Today, we are reviewing a game, Baldur's Gate 3, for the PC and PlayStation 5. Much mahalo to Laren Studios, providing a game code for this review. Ever dreamt of entering a universe where your post bra squad suddenly stumbles upon surprise shenanigans in a seemingly serene barn? Enter Baldur's Gate 3, Larian Studios' epic saga of choices, adventures, and even the occasional humor that will make you spit out your drink. Drawing inspiration from Larian's magnum opus, Divinity, Original Sin, Baldur's Gate 3 is like its bolder and wilder sibling. It's a vast RPG tapestry interwoven with captivating tales from temperamental gods and elves of lovelorn woes to ferocious dwarves. In the midst of this, there are, let's say, unexpected barnyard rendezvous. My 45-hour escapade took me from mysterious cults and regrettable tiefling skirmishes to confrontations with nature-loving druids. Mind you, this was all a prelude to setting foot in the legendary city itself. But it's not all over the place action. Baldur's Gate 3 crafts a deep, resonating story. And before you're thrust into this whirlwind, there's the treat of designing your protagonist. This isn't just about choosing a face or a race. It's a meticulous menu of options ranging from 11 core races, a staggering 31 sub-races, very gender options, yep, even non-binary, distinctive voices, and, brace yourselves, customizable private parts. It's a journey of self-reflection, fantasy fulfillment, and maybe a bit of hilarity as you prepare to venture through this renowned, forgotten realms. Soon after creation, you're embroiled in a tale of abduction by the mind flares, nefarious beings armed with a dread-inspiring psychic abilities. These baddies implant a ticking time bomb of sorts, a cerebral parasite. After a daring escape sequence, you find refuge in Faerun, triggering a quest to oust the imminent Mind Flare transformation. If you've never rolled a 20-sided die in a Dungeons & Dragons session, fear not. Baldur Gates 3 serves a stellar initiation with a masterful narrator guiding the way. Through its mechanics and storytelling, I, a rookie to the world of tabletop RPGs, felt warmly welcomed into Dungeons & Dragons' intricate realm. The turn-based combat system, reminiscent of those Saturday evening Dungeons & Dragons sessions, emphasizes strategy. But I must admit, the game's vast scope occasionally led to tiny annoyances, a camera angle, playing hard to get, or a character having a mind of their own. Speaking of vastness, Baldur's Gate 3 is nothing short of epic. A product of an impressive seven-year development timeline, it's expansive yet meticulous crafted. While minor visual bugs and occasional stubborn camera angles made appearances, the game's sheer magnitude and fluid transitions were easy to appreciate. Its sprawling freedom, though a player's delight, might be intimidating for the more casual gamer. With rumors of a 70-hour requirement for a single playthrough, it's a commitment, but one worth every second. In conclusion, was Baldur's Gate 3 a hit for me? A resounding yes! Even when I wasn't playing, it consumed my thoughts, making me ponder character backstories and ethical choices. Resembling an immersive Dungeons & Dragons session, Baldur's Gate 3 for me is less of a game and more of a cherished memory. Kudos, Larian Studios, for this RPG jam. 
And that's our review of Baldur's Gate 3 for the PC and PlayStation 5. Hope you guys like this game review. And if you did, don't forget to give it a like. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. We also stream on Twitch and TikTok. So if you want to hang out, talk about other stuff besides games or talk about games, feel free to drop in in the streams. We also host podcasts across worlds talking about anime, manga, and other things we're interested in. So if you like that kind of stuff, links to the podcast are in the description below. Other than that, my name is Lehua and this is the Superfina channel reviewing the game Baldur's Gate 3 for the PC and PlayStation 5. Hope you guys like this video and we'll see you on the next one. Ahoy ho!